everyone, it's Megan, and I'm not peeling, nor am I red. I mean, I was just touching my face over here, so that's why it's a bit red there, but I am not red. I'm not peeling. There is no difference. So I didn't record the last few days. Um, one, because life got really busy. And then after day three that you saw in a previous clip, um, after that nothing changed with my skin. My skin really didn't do anything. Actually, I ended up breaking out more along my jawline. I broke out um, and I broke out over here too, like after day two. I think it was after day two or it might have been day three I think it was day two I actually woke up with more acne around my chin area and they were the they were really bizarre they were bizarre is all I can say um so I don't know if it was because the blue light is very drying that it made my skin just go and so, thus, more acne. But I really expected there to be some, like, more... M a better difference, because, like, this is my last attempt at... There's not much else I can do when it comes to healing my acne, because I've changed my diet completely. Um, I drink tons of water, I've done Accutane, topicals, tretinoin, retinol, I've done so much to try to get my skin under control, and here I am. And it's really frustrating, and so I didn't hear back from my dermatologist, I don't remember if I mentioned that in my last clip, but I never heard back from my dermatologist. So, um, a little irked about that. Um, and then I am going to see them in a month. I see them on November 20th. So, unless a miracle happens, um, I'm, I don't know what else to do. So, it's like, unless a miracle happens, I might just try blue light again and then not wash the product off, the Levulon, because when I did this last blue light treatment, I washed the Levulon off before um, going under the light, if you saw in my first video. Um, so I don't know if that could have potentially been it, that I washed the product off, so I was just like shining a blue light on my face. But I am not happy with my results so I have questions as to what happened were things done wrong were they done right why am I breaking out even more kind of like why didn't I peel I just have questions so hopefully I can get them answered in a month and then I can come back with another video to explain, hopefully, to explain what happened and possibly what went wrong, what went right, updates, how my skin is doing. So stay tuned for that video in a month, which I am really crossing my fingers for. So hopefully, hopefully if we get this done right, that this will be my breakthrough with my acne but if any of you have like any tips on like acne or anything like Evie has given me so many tips like yojoba oil I feel like I said that wrong and I'm really sorry if I just butchered that um but she's been telling me about like all these oils and um natural moisturizers for your skin um so she's been really trying to give me some more like natural remedies like cut out coffee creamers, which I have. I only put almond milk in my coffee, so thank you, Evie. Um, and 
sugars. I I don't eat gluten anymore. I don't eat dairy. Um, and then try to use more like natural products on your skin, which is what I'm trying because what do I have to lose? So if you have any advice on how maybe you are helping your acne or any other videos that you know of of people who are um, fixing their acne, I would love to see them. Please recommend them to me. And so I will see you with another acne update in one month's time. Stay tuned.